The charred remains of Nuke London are the backdrop for MFL action at Flumbly Stadium, which proved again today why it's the cheating capital of the league by towing every car in the parking lot to the team-owned impound next door. Yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The Cleveland Burns take on the New London Patriots. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting, a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. What you ask for, Grim. And it's first and ten. Interception, and that's how you stop an offense. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Second down and a lot. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You got to keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You got to make that catch. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. First down and one. his way out of that time. And that's a run for no gain. And that'll bring up second and one. Whoa, and he laterals the ball. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? And that'll bring up third and one. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs>
It's first and ten. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and seven. Third down and, well, good luck. And there's another foul. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. The defense uses the Time Warp Dirty Trick to erase that last play. I think all those team physicists really paid off. And you said they were crazy. and stumbling he could go all the way oh my god a man from prison just came out of the field that's the ref you idiot let's see what the penalty is <laughs> first down and forever and he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And another interception. This cut with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. First and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. First down and three. He's not just burning down the house, and he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? The players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. He's 
not going down. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and six. I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this. Oh, did he take a punishing hit? You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? Yeah, the white juice at the Hooters chicken wings last night? Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and then, then the police horse is out front in the stadium earlier. That was just a joke slam. But the horse took it seriously. Not surprised. And that's a catch for three. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> that's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. Second down and seven. First down. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. First down to seven. Pick up for six yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Third and four. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger pick. Oh, man, Brooks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. And it's first and ten. Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me of that Tom Hanks. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a throw that good, man! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. Oh, he just got crushed. Second down in a very lot. First and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader.
second down and ten. It looks like the defense has got our shrinking pills. Ah, that's a ginormous dirty. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. They're getting on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a sawbuck riding on this asshole. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, with the brain scrambler. The defense is running low on line bashers. They have only two left. They need to play smart from here on out. That's defense, Grim. You're asking too much of them. And it's first and ten. One speed. Oh, with the punishing hit. First and ten. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. warming up. The offense just burned the defense pretty hard on that one. That is still edible though. Just gotta scrape off the charred parts. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. That's bleak, Bricks. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. No, oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. catch on the play every little bit counts those free yarders might grow up to be somebody one day second down and seven does the qb know which team he's on i don't even know where i'm at oh with the brutal hit And it's first and ten. Two minutes remain in the half. Wait! I gotta take a dump! Second down and long. Bam! 
Adams, say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And these guys been kicking us for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And they run it in for two points. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Well, I turned on the light. It wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And he's off to the races. down to keep the drive alive and he takes a time out here they have two left i wonder if he has a plan well maybe he's just gonna take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play and the quarterback drills one in for the first down the quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it i know i am And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Bricks, Max Stupsy. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man. Boom! <laughs> and it's first and ten. calls a timeout this is why you save your timeouts you can use them in the two-minute warning now i get it makes sense grim when in a hurry up offense the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock oh he almost broke that one walk and that's a hell of a cheap shot <laughs> gotta love it They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors. And we need money more than they do. <laughs> oh, man, his neck vertebrae. Oh, man, talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay, he just ran into a buzzsaw. <laughs> And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. Welcome back. Hope you enjoyed the carnage during today's halftime show. Obviously, they need to play a lot harder here in the second half to make a game of it. Or they could start cheating and killing. That's what I'd do.
When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And he sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. First and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Second down and a lot. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah, that's why he's so popular with the other kids. The ones not on this. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98. It's a real blow to the team. He's at the 40. He's at the... And the defense is on his heels. He's at the 10. He did it. He scores. And with that amazing run, he first... Hey, yeah, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. The defense has only one line basher left, and they need to keep him alive to avoid forfeiting. The offense lost another running back, and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Do us something we don't know, genius. Second down, and we've got a pick. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Second down, and ain't going to happen, partner. This guy's a brick sh Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. First and ten. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. First and four. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. And I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed thing, Fred. He's running from his name. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. 
Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And he breaks away. Boom to the moon. Another loser fights the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. I own a hell of a fellow. And the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Looks like the defense. Oh, he was hitting mid hurdle and fumbles the ball. We know this quarterback likes to play with soft balls, but the defense, they're playing with big balls and just crushed his balls. That's a lot of balls, Grim. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, uh, uh, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Yeah, I've had it. I'm running out of it. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And it looks like we've got a penalty here. is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. First down and three. Point, so they're going for two. And he makes the grab and adds two points to their score. This is an MFL reminder that humans can dance, but you still can't do the robot. Let's not forget the great misunderstanding and purge of 2071. You know now. You know what <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill.
And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that. He's leaving it all out on the field today. And there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's a gallbladder. Ah, oh, my bad. running back no rest for the weary the last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die quarter three comes to an end but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter and it's first and ten You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Third down and, well, good luck. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. First down and seven. They're going for two points. And he plows forward for the two-point conversion. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. It's better to be lucky than good, which is boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And that'll bring up second and one. Trick. Fee fi fo fum stomp him into the ground, the dirt. And that's another turnover for the defense. He could go up. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Now, there are 
there's some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some... Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Huh, I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, friend. Second down and nine. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> First down and one. Wow. The he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. He goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Defense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry-up. Yeah, same as Brits's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit set. Oh, nice hit. That's the way you do it. Let him have it and then take it away. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than complete. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And the cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world.
Second down and more than the QB would like. He broke free and has open field in front of him. First down and one. You can't keep a good mutant down. Man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down and seven. Two minutes left in the game. Hang on. Second down and seven. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. My couch. What is this, 80s wrestling? Oh. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback calls us. I don't know if he even had a target on that throw. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. They could not connect on that play. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without no... I know I said another hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and first time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Can I kill him? And the quarterback finds his man for the... Oh! You knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Ravy blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end. season dumbass actually i think he's talking about the time warp dirty trick that the defense just played still a dumbass though the quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense and with another pick the qb says I don't almost throw interceptions, but when I did... And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> and it's 
First and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his slow with the brain scrambler. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? You know, you got to put the buzz on the MVP conversation, Briggs. Got more kills than anyone in the league right now. Yeah, you make a good point. You want to take some fun on your time. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. <laughs> Second down, and they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up in the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that. The Nuked London Patriots win today's game. Folks, this wasn't even close. It was a total shellacking, like watching a knife cut through butter. More like an axe through butter, Grim. More like a chainsaw through baby shit, because that pretty much describes what we just saw. And the MVP of today's game is just about to speak. As soon as he gets his jaw back in place. Oh, there he's got it now. Yep. with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...